<laughs> Roy was, um, I'm just going to be honest. Roy's not pleased at some of the behavior and some of the etiquette of the cast members of the Eastside Dave show. Makes me mad, buddy. They're not cool. And he wants to return to Professor Roy's cool school. Cool school. This is where Roy reminds you, the Eastside Dave show member, on how to be cool yeah, on the right. ESDS. Because now, I, I have, know how yeah. to be cool. How Roy does know that? how to be cool. Look at Roy. Look, look at his red coat. Um, Roy's going to sit next to me. Now listen, yeah. I had nothing to do with this back of the room, so don't even <laughs> fucking look at me. All right, everybody, I'm you ready? dead serious. Nothing to do with this. Before this is I all can... Roy. David, you're... <laughs> there we go. I'm taller than you. Yeah, but... I'm 6'2", legit. You're like 4'8". Can you guys hit me with a little cool music? Oh. There we go. Oh, that's pretty fucking cool, boys. Thank you. All right, lesson number one. Don't ever turn your back on the camera. Just don't ever walk in front of it with your back to the camera, ever. Failure to comply will result in a ball to the face. <laughs> you know what that means, right, David? <laughs> All right. I, I'm, I'm assuming it does not, it doesn't mean a testicle. No. It means one the of the face. baseballs. It's part of your body. Okay, all right. Number two. That's right. Never like that look rule. at yourself on the camera monitors. It makes you look unprofessional and ugly. <laughs> The only people who look at themselves on camera are narcissists and ugly people. Failure to comply will result in another ball to the face. <laughs> you get it one? back there? Yes. Huh? Yes. Sorry, you guys yes, listening? Sir. All right, here's another one. Let me tell you something. This one. He sent this to me unprompted yeah. yesterday. Right. So this was on his mind for six days. It's been bugging me, buddy. Okay. <laughs> Number three, don't clap in front of the cat microphones. It, it makes you sound like a seal or a special needs child. Failure to comply? Go ahead, David. You tell him. Ball to the face. Thank you. A baseball to the face. Yes. Number four. Now, this isn't going to anyone in particular, but rather everybody. Don't look at your phone for any reason if you want to sit on the couch. If you're a member <laughs> of the audience on the bleachers, <laughs> you can You're pretty much talking to Flutzy. But Let's we, be honest. We appreciate your discretion. He, he is. He's Fail talking to you, Flutzy. Failure to comply, Will? Ball to the face. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. I appreciate your support on this. You're, I, I am 100% behind all of these thus far. Now, here's another one. Not to anyone in particular, but uh, number five, don't leave the room during the bit unless it's a medical emergency or you've got a really good excuse. It's distracting. If you must leave, please don't return until the bit has ended. <laughs> Failure to comply? Ball to the face. Thank you. Next. <laughs> Stop asking David to be paid. This poor man cannot pay you. It's not up to him. And we're not hiring. Well, actually, we would love to hire you all, but we oh. can't afford to. Oh. And we don't have a contract anymore anyway. So, <laughs> so it doesn't, we're not even getting paid. Listen, if you want to go, if you want to be paid by Compound Media, number one, produce your own show. Then talk to Keith Maresca and Anthony Cumia. Don't mention David or my name in any of this negotiation with Compound Media Management. Otherwise, you get a... Ball the face. Thank you, buddy. Number seven. <laughs> this one goes out to you, Bobo. <laughs> you, can't, you can't sing the closing theme. I'm sorry. You have a lovely voice when you speak, but singing it rubs us a little bit. Leave, that, leave, the, leave the professional singing up to David and myself. Now, I actually don't even hear yeah. him singing, but you do have a musician's ear. Yeah. Okay, it's, it's bad. Sometimes he, he sings, he sings like sharp. shit. A little sharp. Sharp. A little sharp. Sharp might as well be shit. Yeah, just move your mouth like Millie Vanilli if you want to feel the need. Bo, Roy thinks you sing like shit. But the good news is, Bobo, that uh, if you do sing, uh, you're not going to get a ball to the face, so you're oh. all right. All right, that's not so bad. All right, next one. Number eight. There's going to be a new rule. This one goes out to Jimmy, but he's not here. Uh, <laughs> if you want to attend the East Side Dave show taping, you'll need to bathe or shower at least 16 hours before the show starts. <laughs> if you don't, I wish Jimmy was here to hear this, but uh, 16 we're hours. gonna have to cut the spit and send it to Jimmy. <laughs> okay. We will ask you to leave and uh, let the entire world know you smell like a dumpster. Oh man. It's harsh, I know. That is a rough one. On a, high, on a good note, David, though, we will not hit you with a ball to the face. Okay. Uh, I am willing to say 60% of the people in the room right now have not showered within the last 16 hours. I'm gonna say that right now. Now that I'm sitting as close as I am to you, David, I'm starting I'm to really- I'm sickly, I'm sickly. That's the reason that for my been, odor. That might've been right to you, buddy. <laughs> Number nine, let's all stop being animals, huh? I should leave it at that. 
<laughs> but what I mean is, stop shouting out loud to get David's attention. This isn't Larry's, uh, let's get loud. <laughs> If you want David's attention, please raise your hand and wait your turn like you've been doing since first fucking grade. Jesus now, Christ, if, he's angry. Oh, yeah. So now this this one is going right up. This, this is another one to Boba. If your Eastside Dave character is appearing on other terrible shows, you cheapen the brand that David and I have been building for over four years. Before you make an appearance on another show, ask yourself the following question. Would Oprah do this podcast? <laughs> Oh Would God. David and Roy do this podcast? <laughs> Why hasn't David and Roy done this podcast already, even if they've been asked a thousand fucking times? Number four, will it help my brand? Do I really have a brand or a career? <laughs> Bo? Why do I seek love from strangers on the internet? <laughs> and what parent didn't love me enough? Thank you, David. Jeez. Is there more in here? <laughs> There's one more, Roy. Oh, shit. You wrote all of these. Yes, I wrote all these. These are very, very harsh. Yes, but I'm feeling good about myself I know, now, it's David. good, it's good. It's cathartic. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm, listen, I'm with you here. We love you all. Right, don't we, David? We do. We do love every person here, including the people watching. Very much so. Uh, we recognize the value that you bring to our show. However, how can the audience respect you if you don't respect yourselves? Mm. It's never too late to become a respectable member of society. Oh, yeah. Start by getting an actual job, practice good hygiene, respect your body, and be cool. <laughs> and become the person that we all know you can be. Roy Harder is cool school. <laughs> Professor Roy. Don't clap in front of the fucking microphone. Oh, sorry about that. All right. <laughs> Roy Harder. Thank you. Come on. Thank you for letting me hear it. Do it away from the microphones. <laughs> Do it away from the microphones. Um.